All right, everybody, man, we've been waiting for this, man. We've been waiting for this, man. Today, man, we're getting ready to watch South Park, new special, Into the Pandaverse. If y'all want to watch this full video, no jumps, no skips, no zoom-ins, nothing like that, man. Make sure you check it out over on the Patreon, man, right? It's only $3 a month. All right, man, here we go. Here we go, here we go. And there's Charmin. Are you still here? <laughs> you need to get going. I can't get going. I told you I don't feel well. Okay. What's the matter now? Oh, nothing. I just had explosive f***ing diarrhea all night because you decided oh to God. get us KFC for dinner. <laughs> you have KFC all the time. Yeah, and I have diarrhea all the time. That's You're true. You're staying home all day and playing Baldur's Gate 3. Now let's go. I should have known they just trying to manipulate already. Ugh. I should have known. Have a good day at school, sweetie. F*** you, Mom. Petty. <laughs> All right, so what's the deal with them, man? This, this is, hold on, real quick. This is crazy, bro. This is crazy. So that's Kyle, right, with the big nose. That's Kenny. Somebody said, some, y'all been saying, Kenny is hot. All oh, this, y'all y'all silly as hell. Now, I don't know, man. Cartman is, that the character for Cartman, I don't know how old they're supposed to be. I don't really know how old they're supposed to be. I don't, I don't think they're, like, normal, everyday girls. But I don't know. I don't know. We'll see, That's bro. bullshit. How do you get your mom arrested for child boys. abuse? She wouldn't let you stay home and play Baldur's Gate 3, huh, fat ass? <laughs> Who you calling fat, you heathen bitch? Dude, you don't want to miss school stay. today. Clyde said he's going to fart on Timmy Mullins doing P.E. Looking ass, well, Stand look like uh, 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 Letty off of, uh, what, is it Letty, bro? Off of Fast and Furious, Fast and Furious franchise and shit, boy. Tammy Mullins has sweet knockers. Dude, Kenny, enough about Tammy's knockers. You sound like a white male trying to reestablish the patriarchy. Oh, ah, 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 oh, it's all ah, a dream. Eric, it's okay. It's I got, okay. Matt, Matt, I had a dream that I was replaced by a diverse woman. Oh, not again. <laughs> yeah, only this time, it wasn't just me. They were taking all my favorite people and replacing them with diverse women complaining about the patriarchy. Oh, shit. Will you check under the bed and make sure there's no Disney executives under there? I yeah, because that's who's doing not. it. I'm scared, Mom. Will you please just look and make sure Kathleen Kennedy isn't under my bed? I feel like I heard that name before. I don't know who Kathleen Kennedy is, but I feel like I've heard that name before. Like, I don't know. She's some big time somebody. I, Cause I remember seeing it. I remember seeing it like she made some change or something like that. I don't know, man. But y'all, y'all, let me know who Kathleen Kennedy is. Kathleen Kennedy is not under your bed. Can you check the closet, Eric? Enough. I've told you there's no such thing as Disney executives who replace everyone you love with diverse women who complain about the patriarchy. Now sure. be a big boy. <laughs> yes, it is. It, it's not real. It, it's not real. No, oh, this is Disney. Oh, but South Park. Is this the South Park? <laughs> Joining the Pandaverse. Okay, there we go. Get up. Come Damn. on, Dad, get up. Let's go. What, Dad? Downstairs. Let's go. I'm sick of this shit. <laughs> oh, you're on your ass. <laughs> okay. It has come to my attention lately that young people today don't know how to do shit. You well, got your phones and your AI, and you kids haven't learned to be able to actually do anything. Well, who's the parents, though? Like, you know what I'm saying? Your kids haven't learned to do shit. I'm like, okay, that's that's understandable. But who is the parents? It's the parents' jobs to teach the kids. The fact is, us as parents, bro, we got spoiled, man. We get spoiled. We don't know how to do nothing because we don't need to do anything anymore, bro. So we're going to take this morning to learn how you know to fix I mean. something. See this? See this? The oven door isn't working. It's falling off the hinges. Okay. So what do we do? Shelly? I don't know. Yeah, she don't know. It's very simple. You got to make the hinges tighter so the oven door is more secure. Right. So what you do is you take out your phone and you call the handyman. <laughs> Hello, it's Randy Marsh. My oven door is not working. Please of come course. fix it. I should have known with his dramatic ass. I should have known his dramatic ass was going to do some shit like that, bro. You take out your phone and you call... The handyman. I'm like, bro, yeah, of course, of course, of course, bro. I should have known Randy wasn't going to fix it himself. Now we rest until the handyman comes. I should have known. I should have known. Yep. Can't get her fixed right now. I got to get some damn at the Home Depot. Goomba face ass, boy. Your boy, I lost all your teeth and damn. 
Okay, do that. Can't do it right now. I gotta get over to Steven Stouch's house and install his closet shelves. Okay, see kids, this happens sometimes, but handymen don't make a lot of money, so here's what you do. Oh, okay. Hmm. I will pay you an extra 30 bucks if you fix my oven now. Okay. Yeah, sorry, but Stouch already gave me an extra 50 bucks. I will pay Damn. you an extra 55 bucks. Randy, did that, that's not a good that's not a good jump. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm like, I'd have been like, bro, look, pay me another hundred and I'm cool. I'll stop what I'm doing right now. I'll tell him we gotta push this stuff back and I'll go and get this done. Bro, you know what I'm saying? You gotta you gotta charge a little bit more up. Did you, you fix know? the oven door yet? I'm working on it! Look, please, whatever you want, I'll throw in a <laughs> six-pack of beer and you can get drunk. Well, I don't need your trivial little perks anymore, Marsh. I got work coming out my ears. It's <laughs> like, I don't know, it's like nobody knows how to do shit anymore. It's like, I don't know, like I'm, my mouth is full of water. You know what I'm saying? I just can't quite open it. Uh, you, well, a mouth full of gonna silly leave. putty. I'll pay a different handyman. Yeah, go for it, buddy. I got so much money, I don't care. <laughs> I told you. I told you, ugly. What's going on? Bacon strip nose ass. I was boy. walking down the school hallway. Nope. Got that and ass. And I see Butters. And he's like, hey, Eric, you want to <laughs> see what my mom packed me for lunch? That's Butters. That's when I start to notice <laughs> something's wrong. Everyone I cared about has been systematically replaced. And finally, I want to scream, and I'm like, why are they replacing every single character with someone who is diverse? But then Kenny's like, it's not our fault, it's because of Kathleen Kennedy. But then Kathleen Kennedy says, like, fuck it, make it my name. And then oh. the town is like, no, please, Kathleen Kennedy, stop ruining everything. But Kathleen Kennedy is all like, put another gay diverse woman in it, make it my fucking name. And the Disney stock just keeps going That's down crazy. and down and down. And then Bob Iger is all like, no, no, what's going on with my stars? No, Kathleen Kennedy. <laughs> Hey, you know, that's a shame, bro, because that's literally happening in society. I ain't going to make this long, but look, I'm telling you, that's happening. I've been having so many discussions with my friends, people in the ODG, man, people over on the Patreon page, bro. Everybody, bro. Even even with y'all on here, bro, I be talking to y'all about that, bro. They always want to come in and change, make things diverse, make things different, pander to everybody. I, that shit lame to me. Because one, they're not doing it in order to make people feel like good about like, oh man, it's good to see a black little mermaid. Oh my God, I I, I typically go to that because it's recent. That's it's not because I have a problem with it. I'm like, they want to make a black little mermaid. I'm like, that's great. But at the same time, why does the black little mermaid have to be Ariel? Ariel was white. It is what it is. It is fine. I don't want to see Martin Luther King Arab. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to see Martin Luther King white. You know what I mean? I'm just saying, bro, I don't need to see that. And that's what Hollywood does. It's like instead of making something new, they want to take something old that people like already getting used to and accustomed to from decades, switch it up and make it either gay or black or black and gay. And, you know, it changes up. And recently I've been seeing a lot of Chinese things. It's like, bro, just make something new. I'm not against nothing. Like, don't take this the wrong way. I'm not against nothing. I'm just saying, bro, make some new shit, bro. Make something new. That's all. Huh. Just they throwing it out there. Y'all are going to get mad. Okay, don't get mad at me. I think I know what's going make on Make something here. new. Your fears aren't about Disney replacing everything you love. What everyone is afraid of these days is being replaced by AI. AI? Really? But you don't need to worry, Eric. As long as you work hard and stay in school, you can make something of yourself. Become an elite worker like I did that AI can't replace. AI you know, definitely can replace you. Tell me to stay in school? <laughs> You're in control of your future, Eric. You just need to ask yourself, who will be the people still making money in the AI-driven future? I'm sorry. I think AI probably can replace a therapist, though. I'm not saying they can do a better job than a therapist. I'm not saying that uh, AI would be just this magical thing, but I think that... For the most part, I think it could definitely replace a therapist, and I think people would pay less for it because they're like, man, I don't care if I don't care if I get less help or not personalized help. I'm, you know, I'm using AI and it's cheaper. You know what I'm saying? That's what they're gonna see. What the what the? Fuck? <laughs> Ugly old man. But, but come on now. Could you hurry it up, please? Ass. I kind of need to get back to work. Well, looks like you got a short in the outlet there. I'd have to get a new outlet at Home Depot. I can probably come change it on the 28th. Damn. 28th? No, 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 look. I'll give you 100 bucks to get this done today. I already got a fella giving me thousands to fix his toilet this afternoon. What? Thousands? <laughs> I can't afford that. 
free therapy sessions. How about we trade? You Hell do the no. handiwork for me, and I'll give you five free therapy sessions. No. Oh, no thanks. I do all my therapy on the AI Freud bot app. What did I just say? I know this, I know this is just a cartoon, quote, quote. What did I just say? Stop playing, bro. They, gonna have, they, they got an app for that. What was that a slogan of? Apple? Got milk? Tom, I'm standing Jeez. in my bathroom where the new tile for my shower has yet to be installed. Hmm. As you can see, the tile has started to peel off in places. Now, the handyman was supposed to come days ago to fix <laughs> it, but he claims to have better offers from other white-collar workers tub. like me whose practical know-how has atrophied. That's a deep-ass tub for him to step in it and still be the same height, bro. You got to think. It appears we've all screwed ourselves by relying on technology and AI. Yeah, buddy. Boy, and it's only going to get worse. It's going to be some iRobot shit, bro. Y'all going to be looking hey, at that Siri, Will Smith movie. <laughs> how do you fix a broken oven door? And Will Smith is not going to help us. He's not going to help us. All that, all that shit y'all been talking about Will Smith. I've been talking a little shit, too. All, all that. You better call Jada. She, she better get Zion or something like that with the Matrix. It's crazy. All that stuff y'all been talking about, Will Smith. You don't ask him to help with the robots. And when the zombies come, don't ask him for that. Because he ain't your legend no more. Here's Look at what him. I found from reference.com. Undo any screws that hold the hinges in position. Pull the door upward and then outwards to detach hinges from the oven. See? And Randy, get ready to do it, bro. That's what I'm saying. That's all you got to do. Look it up and do it. Insert the new hinge into the hinge holes and secure the hinges with screws. You will need to call a handyman. The handyman isn't available. He's all like rich okay, now and mind. I fucking rely on him to keep everything working here. Never mind, bro. I am unable to fix an oven door. Oh, is well, that what he asked? Hey, sir? Siri, I thought AI was supposed to be this amazing, scary advancement that could like do anything. Hey, Randy, the oven door in the kitchen still isn't. I am working on it. <laughs> she hey, mad. Siri, all the handymen are rich and I can't afford them anymore. So what do I do? Perhaps you could find an unlicensed worker who does small day jobs for cash. Mm. You mean like those broke ass illegal immigrants down at Home Depot? I, that that was racist. That was racist. That was racist. They be at Lowe's too. No, 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 stop. Just stop. Just stop. I'm just joking. But I'm just saying that was racist, bro. bro the broke ass illegal. They ain't broke. They be having some money, bro. They be having some bread. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said it that way. Hey, Siri. You mean like those broke-ass illegal immigrants down at Home Depot? Oh, wow. Yes. There are often people sitting out front of Home Depot waiting to be hired for work. Yeah. We those know what guys. happens. We know what happened in the future. That well, AI get that crazy. You told Tammy Mullins he was going to fart on her in PE, so she didn't show up. Well, well, no, Pony. Well, Kenny, everyone say? was really looking forward to that. Why did you ruin it? I told you guys, I've been playing more of a full fucking knocker. Yeah, yeah! He said she got yeah, huge yeah. fucking knackers. Something super crazy is happening, you guys. You went on a diet? This is serious now! <laughs> At first, they were just dreams. But now I feel like it's I'm actually ass. changing. Why would I be having visions that I'm a diverse woman? Because you're a fat, racist piece of shit? Damn. God damn it, I'm not fat. I'm just shamed for my body in a world where white men decide what's beautiful. <gasps> what? Oh, because I was so like, what, boy? <laughs> like, shut up, bro. I get that's the other woman leaking out of him or something the like that. The fuck was that? Why would I say that? I don't say that. You see? This is happening to all of us, you guys. You might think everything is okay, but Disney is gonna get you. Kathleen Kennedy. <laughs> he pinched him. He pinched him. Kathleen Kennedy is gonna get you. <laughs> I don't think that what I'm experiencing are dreams. I think that what I'm seeing are windows into alternate universes. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm out. Damn, they it's don't even believe you. There could be other universes with other versions Everyone's of us. Everyone's sick of the stupid multiverse, Cartman. It's not stupid. It's totally possible. And if you can't... Uh-oh. I swear, the multiverse is just an excuse for lazy writing. Whoa, yeah, it's cow. like every damn movie now. Cow right, well, it ain't lying. Uh, you might want to listen to him, Kyle. Somebody get Daddy, them. Daddy, 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 get him. Get him. Why did he just... Well, but, but here's another thing. Why did he just call Kyle? That's what I'm saying, bro. He love Kyle, man. That's his boy, man. Because he always called Kyle. He just saved Kyle. In the last episode, which is crazy because, you know, this is new and that last episode is old as shit. But go back and watch that. Anyways, I'm just saying, bro, he done saved Kyle, right? Multiple times. I think Kyle, did Kyle ever save Carmen, bro? That's a that's a good question. He always calls for Kyle. You know, he really loves and respects that dude, man. They got a rivalry, but they're like, 
Because Kilo Carmen don't have any brothers and sisters, so well he does have a half brother, but yeah. They not gonna they're not gonna be ever be cool again. Ever. So, hey! Hey, I need a worker! Is that a handyman? Oh, 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 like a, I like a house. sex worker. What the fuck? Randy, you know how to do stuff, right? I gotta get the radiant heat installed in my house and I'm offering free legal advice in exchange. You, you need a need reporter? That. I'll report the news to you if you fix my shower tile. Huh? I get it, bro. They got they spent a lot of time and a lot of energy and possibly money on working on things that don't really make a lot of sense. Not not saying that legal advice is bad, but what I'm saying is that if I had to build a town, legal advice probably would be the last thing on the list. That's like a service that is a is a good service, but it's like the last thing on the list. I probably need people that are in the medical field cuz people are going to get sick. People that are can know how to build houses. Know how to do infrastructure, know how to pour concrete, know how to work power tools, know how to work all of this stuff. Do plumbing. I'm going to need that first. I mean, you need teachers first. You need all of these different things that you really need somebody to know how to do instead of somebody who this guy has a loan investment, customer support representative in the back, scripts and screenplay, like medical transportation in the back. That's See, that's interesting. It's like, bro, you know, even even they, what is this, accounting advice? Right, because Token's dad is an accountant. It's like all these things you can necessarily do if you just had the right information. But these men right here, they just do it better because that is a part of their, that's that's their niche in society. But it's not necessarily a necessity. A necess why can I say it? Did you did you see me struggle on a nipple? A nipple. A nipple. A nipple. I'm a computer programmer. I can do coding. Freak. Insurance broker? Insurance broker? What the hell are you guys doing here? And We're he said we. trying to get a handyman to so. do stuff for us. You know how to install radiant heat or not. Hell no. no. I, I need some broke ass immigrants to fix my oven door. Oh, oh, man, dang it. And hey, the immigrants ain't there. Handyman. Handyman. Hey, anyone want to make a bunch of money? I need four workers who know how to use a power saw. They don't I'll know. I'll do lawyer work if you install my radiant heat. I've got skills and human resources. Let's work something out. That's not going to no, be No, I shit. need guys who know how to work a power saw. None of you know how to work a power saw. You could just train them. Wait, you hold on. Just talking about Jesus Christ. Bro. You, are, you out there looking for it. All they got to do is just go and train some people, bro. That's it. What Am universe is this? Uh oh, Randy knows something ain't right. Are you like in love with Tammy Mullins? I'm not in love with her. I just like her knockers. Okay, well, why would you protect someone from getting farted on unless there were some real feelings there? Yeah, Dude, buddy. I said I was sorry, okay? You guys, you guys! They're freaks! Something really <laughs> weird is going on. I keep having the same dream that I'm a fat little white boy. This is interesting that this is literally almost the same situation, just in a different universe, bro. I, I really like that, though. You ain't white, but you definitely fat. Okay. This is serious, Big Cal. Nose ass. It's more than a dream. It's becoming, like, real now. I keep seeing all of you being Girl, replaced by little white motherfuckers. Well, maybe you should try not being so racist, Cartman. You can't be <laughs> racist towards white people, Stan. They all honky ass. <laughs> you know what this <laughs> what? is? I think this is some alternate universe shit. Everybody can be racist towards everybody. Let's just clear the myth. Yeah, right. You just acting crazy because you want to get sent home from school. No, I'm not, Cal. Yeah, you just want to get sent home so you can play Baldur's Gate 3. Kind of wow. does. <laughs> Damn. What the fuck? You ugly as hell, boy. N nasty rat face, and m a mouse with a wig. Oh my God, it's all real. Girl, you look uncut. Whatever you're doing, Carmen, we ain't buying it. Stay away from me. You aren't my friends, do you understand? Oh, Is God. that supposed to be Cartman? It ain't <laughs> Cartman, but it's still fat. Just more like little round and fat. Yeah, like <laughs> Tammy Mullen's knocker. Kenny, bro, <laughs> chill with the knockers, man. I like the fact that Kenny in this part uh, has more clear speaking roles. You know what I'm saying? It's just not all muffled. You know what I'm saying? It's just, it's just interesting. Yeah. Different reality. Yeah. Everybody's woman. Everybody, yeah, everybody's a woman. Well, I'm not. You guys, you guys. Uh, Holy shit, you guys. I fucking told uh, you. I fucking told you this was happening, didn't I? What was happening? I told you I was having all these dreams that I was a fat little white boy and you guys are all white boys too. And now look, y'all actually turned into them. 
Damn. Do we know you? <laughs> they don't. I'm oh, Cartman, shit. and you're a cow, and you're Stan, and you're fucking Kenny. Only it's a parallel alternated universe, and y'all have been replaced. <laughs> well, it was uh, the parallel. Okay, cool, lady. <laughs> we gotta get to class. Oh no, 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 no! You guys are gonna listen to me this time. Got a little uh, cake back there. I need help. I'm not looking though. Carmen's just, just messing with us. Fuck you, cow! This is serious, you fucking butt fucker. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, listen, lady, we really gotta get going. Will you guys fucking listen to me? I'm Cartman. You're not Cartman, and multiple universes are stupid. I'm gonna have to bleep out a lot of stuff just to, just to get this on YouTube. But remember, remember, fam, you can't go down to the link in the description, bro. You can you can watch this over on the Patreon, bro. But only it's only three dollars, bro. I got a whole bunch of stuff over there, and this will be the full video, bro. No bleeping out nothing. No skips, no oh, jumps. God damn it! Had to just throw that Tom, in there. I'm still here live at the scene. Dozens of white collar workers are gathered hoping to get the attention of just one handyman. Gotcha. It's a scene of desperation and a reminder of where our country's economy is at. We don't need you reporting, my, my man. Just shut up. Hey, 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 I can trade you services. Hmm. I have geology skills. Could you come fix my door and I'll give you some geology? You gotta have that money. Hey, why don't you guys get out of here? You making the Home Depot look all cheaty. Uh, all cheaty. <laughs> Fucking rich assholes. It's crazy, bro. It's crazy how society will flip when you put the people that were in power, make them poor, and you put the people that poor and make them in power, give them some money, You'll see how it's almost like a natural human instinct to do that to people. So while a lot of people be judging rich people and be like, oh, you're an asshole. It's just like you put in that same position, given to some some certain stances, circumstances. And besides the evil people, bro, a lot of people would act like that. A lot of people would. A lot of people. That's why they say money's the root of all evil. No, it's not. It's just people. Stuff. I'd be rich, too. It's just people. I could know how to fix stuff. The problem is, when I could have been learning how to fix stuff, I went to fucking college instead. Right. Yeah, yeah he's right. Don't go we to college, y'all. Yeah. college. And where did it get us? Yeah, I'm still paying off my college loans. Yeah, so am I. Now I don't know how to do anything, because I got suckered into going to college, right. learning stupid geology, then right. I'm a goddamn AI. Yeah, fuck college. Let's go get our <laughs> fucking money back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, fuck college. He's like, yeah, F college. Yeah. Oh, college. You know what you are? You're a scam. College yeah. is a scam. Not unless you were going to be a doctor or something like that, or a lawyer or something. Yeah, but now nah, college is, yeah, yeah. Man, nah. if you're in college right now, I'm not trying to shit on you, man. I'm just saying, like, like, get into a frat fraternity, whatever. Get as many contacts as you can. Use that for a context. But other than that, man, look, bro. Yeah. People, I'm telling you, it is, hey, it is a scam. Here's my student loan bill that I'm still paying off. Well, guess what? I'm not paying it. And he's not even a geologist anymore. No way. Guess what, college? We don't owe you money. You owe us money. Yeah. It's just a building, bro. You think you could just sit there and not even respond to us, college? Okay. You aren't going to destroy any more lives. All right, bring in the catapult. I don't bring know if it's exactly catapult. college yeah. or the people that like. What what do you call those financial backers, uh, like sponsors, like for college and government agencies? I think I think they're the problem. It's not really the school per se. College is just a school. It's an institute. It's an idea for real. What's for that? Real. That's the catapult. Well, but it's still in the box. Oh, they can't put yeah, it together. Yeah, somebody's got to put it together. <laughs> well, they can't do it. Gonna... Hang on, college. How are we going to break the college if the catapult is still in the box? It's okay. We called the handyman. He's going to build it for us. Oh, God. Basically, learn how to do, uh, what is it, blue-collar work. That's what it is. Hello, gentlemen. What seems to be the problem? Oh, oh. You said you couldn't work today. You are supposed to fix my oven door. Well, I got a lot of jobs here, buddy. This one paid the most today. We all pulled together and offered him $20,000. This is all in a day. He pulled up with a nice ass truck all in a day. It looked like a Rolls Royce too. $20,000, what the fuck are you guys doing? You're gonna make him totally impossible now. Bro, you gotta do something, bro. Aw, what the hell? Sit down, boys. One of our students here says you've been treating them unfairly. 
Treating who unfairly? We didn't do anything. We're just minding our own business and she keeps saying she's Eric Cartman. Okay, and what's wrong with that? Oh, stop it, bro, just stop. What's wrong is it doesn't make any sense. Okay, I see. There's a diverse female where Cartman used to be and you don't like that. Bro, PC principal with your ugly, strong, geo dude face ass, where you know what's going wrong. You know that this ain't, this is a random woman in the school and I'm considering her a woman, not a kid. I don't think she's a kid, okay? In their universe, I think that the their version are more adults. I don't know what's going on, but that's that's their version. We don't need to dissect it. But he knows good and damn well there's a grown woman in this school with kids, and you know what? And that's his problem, but he's a freak, bro. It's not that we don't Something like wrong him. With him. Don't you think that's weird? He beat Cartman up. I don't up. see a problem with it at all. And if you boys don't think Eric can be a black woman, then maybe the problem is you. Shut up. Shut up. What? You think it's perfectly normal that Cartman is suddenly a black woman? You probably don't like that Indiana Jones got replaced by a female either, huh? Probably have a problem with black Spider-Man, too. No, no, Miles Morales is sweet. That's a whole constructed thing with its own character and narrative, and this is just taking Cartman, same old Cartman, and putting a black woman in it. That's it! That is it! I don't mean to be so excited, but that is it. That's all I was trying to say. Exactly. Th didn't I just say the black Spider-Man? Black Spider-Man is cool. Not because he's black. It has nothing to do with being black. He could have been a purple Spider-Man. I don't give a damn. What I'm trying to say is he, you made a whole new character in a whole new reality that does new things and has a new story. That's interesting. Oh, I don't want to use the Little Mermaid as that. But l let me just say the Indiana Jones one because I hate, I, I hate to keep using the Little Mermaid. Indiana Jones one. Just taking Indiana Jones and just making it a woman adds nothing to the story. It's like, it's still the same heroic Indiana Jones, just a woman. Like, why can't it be Indiana Jones' granddaughter? Why can't it be, like, it, you know what I'm saying? Like, it could be a spinoff of the original, but it doesn't necessarily have to be just that person. Like, why can't, you want to make Superman, like, a gay woman? That's fine. Make make him make her come from the Krypton and whatever I think that's the plan. Krypton come from Krypton and come over here and now it's a different Superman in the absence of Superman because probably Superman was on vacation. I don't know in bonbons in some galaxy far far away, bro. Fighting Goku, don't know how the hell he won fighting Goku. That's just another story. Well, you know what <laughs> I think about that, Cal. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> That's what I think about that, Cal. You nasty <laughs> Carmen, dude, what the f is going on? I'll tell you what's going on. You boys feel that your white culture is being threatened, uh? and so you're lashing out with racism. And if you say anything more about racism. a black woman, Carmen, not making any sense, then you can all just have three weeks' detention. Now it's get not, out of my office. It's God, not racism it. <laughs> at all. Fuck you, Cal. You have to help me. <laughs> <laughs> That's the real Carmen. Look at him. And we both told Clyde, okay, you can try to fart on Tammy Mullins later. Kenny won't tell her. And guess what? This little mother does it again. I'm hmm. sorry. She hypnotized me. Everyone's trying <laughs> to enjoy themselves, dude. Why do you keep f***ing it up? Hey, who's the fat little white boy? Who knows? White heterosexual males think they welcome anywhere. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> I can understand. Okay, children, let's take our seats. Today we're gonna talk more oh, about the female exclusion and a strong black woman, bro, with dreads. Oh the lord! The male patriarchy. Oh god! Yeah, yeah. Uh, Butters, who is that sitting next to you? Oh, <laughs> I don't know about us playing Baldur's Gate three, so the bitch did a switcheroo with Spanky here. That is oh, not what's real? going on, and I'm not gonna sit here and be insulted anymore. It's I'm smart for them to think that. In my universe, and I demand to speak to someone with authority. Is there a problem here? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> They all black women, bro. You, you, you fuck. Yeah. And you never win an argument all with a black woman, boy. Memorizing, <laughs> studying. For what? Anyone gets any info they want with the touch of a button. Quizzy, your mom's a black woman. You probably have a sister. Why are you saying these things? Shut up, bro. It was just a damn joke. Can't joke with anybody, but... I mean, I'm just saying. You can, you can make a joke with everybody, but... Disney? Yeah, right. You thought I was going to say it. Look at this. Quizzy, look, I'm tired of your joke. Shut up. All right. Shut up. I think she's ready to go. I was ready. Yeah, right. right. Everybody right. loves right. jokes until the joke okay, is on okay. them. Even at the center of the school. How do we fire it? There, there's a big red button here. Should I press it? Yeah, yeah, let her rip. Damn. That's harsh, ain't it? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe not. Yeah. Yeah.
You don't know if anybody was in that class, bro. They just in the class and get smacked with a boulder, bro. That's a lawsuit. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see them ignore that. I can't wait to see what they do now. Yeah. 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 Uh-oh. Hey, hey, wait. What's that? Something's going on. It's a handyman. <laughs> it's a oh, handyman. Oh, you son of a bitch. He's just going to fix the glass. Oh. Give these billionaires your money, and then another billionaire just comes and profits off of that. Society's so fucked up. That's how it goes, bro. Our stocks are down, and every goes. Disney movie this year has failed. <sighs> we don't understand it, sir. We keep making the same movie over and over and pandering to everyone, but suddenly it's not working. Then we've got to pander harder. No, Look, you gotta I stop. I don't want to have to say it, but I think the problem is Kathleen Kennedy. Kathleen Kennedy has made studios a lot of money. Yes, so is he a studio exec or something like that? Something's changed. For weeks now, she's like, I, I'm look, quick, real quick. Is he a studio? In a minute, I'm gonna look her up, bro. I'm gonna look her been up. Been completely bro. different. I'm asking too many questions. It's true. What if this is a different Kathleen look Kennedy? At his mouth. Bad job. What are you saying, Rick? I'm just saying, isn't it possible that we here at Disney pandered so much? that we've opened a doorway to the Panderverse. Oh, here we go. The Panderverse is just a theory. And yet we do have the Panderstone downstairs. Okay. It's possible that someone has tampered with it somehow. Bro, if you got a damn Panderstone downstairs, bro, nothing is off limits. Th there was a giant Cthulhu running around. He op They opened the gates of the uh, evil realm of hell and it was running around, and it was destroying South Park. There was a giant mega strike sand biting people's nips off at the mall. I'm just saying, bro, at the end of the day, I, it really it really amazes me. It really, they're man bear pig, but maybe, maybe in this reality in South Park, this is not that crazy. Maybe in South Park, things just happen from time to time, but here, it's ridiculous. Well, she's on her way in right now. If you want to tell Kathleen Kennedy you think she's from an alternate universe because we misused the Panderstone, go right ahead. So, oh shit. And here she comes. And it's Carmen. It gotta be Carmen. Of course. <laughs> Is there a problem, people? <laughs> yeah, yo, fat no ass. No problem at all, Mrs. Kennedy. We were just discussing uh, ideas of what to do with the new Prince Eric movie. Put a chick in it, make her gay. What? Uh, yes, Miss Kennedy, uh, some of the execs are just expressing that maybe... Well, well, that maybe we should go a different route than we did with Indiana Jones. Fuck Indiana Jones, put a chicken in it, make her name <laughs> gay! Bro, chill out, bro, chill out, man, look, y'all. Yeah, I'm hollering, bro, look, that is the first part of it, man. We will actually be tuning in to the second part, man. Do your boy favor, man. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you go down. Subscribe to your boy, man. And if you're watching this over on the Patreon, thank you, bro. Um, we're just going to keep going, bro. You don't have to click over to a new part. Um, but I just do want to say thank you. And thank you to everybody. Just thank you to everybody. And I'm just really happy to be here. All right? On to the next. Huh?